Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to enable NumLock on the Windows 10 lock screen. So if you like using the number pads when you're signing into your computer, generally speaking, the NumLock feature is turned off on the logon screen. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu, just left click on the start button one time. Type in reg edit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match should go back to registry editor. You want to right click on that and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. Now before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it so if anything went wrong, you could easily restore it back. And in order to create the backup, it's very simple. Just go ahead and left click on the file tab, select export, file name, I would suggest naming it the date in which you are making the backup, export range should be selected to all and then save it to a convenient location on your computer and if you ever need to import it back in, you just would select file and then import. So again, pretty straightforward process and now we're ready to begin. So we're going to double click on the hkey current user folder, so go double click on that double click on the control panel folder and now there should be a keyboard folder underneath of that go left click on that one time please know you can see our file path up at the top of the registry editor here each backslash is a different folder we've gone under up to this point and now you want to look in on the right side there should be something that says initial keyboard indicators you want to go double click on that for value data you want to delete whatever is in here and then you want to set it to a value I'm going to have in the description of the video. I'm going to paste it in here. Basically, it's just 214-748-3650. So again, 214-748-3650. I will have this in the description of the video as well. And you can see it on my screen here too if you want to pause the video. Select OK. And then once you're done with that, you should be able to restart your computer and NumLock should be enabled when browsing on the lock screen. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.